you're seeing this video right now, then you know my semester is finally over. My first semester at Dongguk University here in Seoul, South Korea is done. It feels weird to be just at my apartment on a weekday and not on campus. It kind of feels strange, but I'm so glad to finally, finally get to some of the things that I've been um, meaning to do. Um, I figured I'd start this video with some unboxing of some PR gifts that we got from some amazing skincare brands here in Korea. I've been so busy with finals week that I haven't been able to open up like my packages and my gifts, but let's open this one up today. Let's see what we got. Let's see what goodies are in here. Let's go. This is like so nice. I don't even know how to open this without making, messing it up. This is from a skincare brand here in South Korea called Purito Soul. Wow, look at this thing. Hold on. I'm gonna pull the camera so y'all can see this. Wow. Rooted in wonder. Whoa. Now this is fire. This is a fire PR gift. Um, yeah, let's see what else it does. My hands are very ashy, but let's see. Oh, there's a switch. It does something after I open it. Hold on, I wanna take pictures of this first. Hey, let's do this. How do I? Oh, be right back. I need some scissors. Okay, here we are. Here we are. Um, you know, so it's here, Rocky. We got my name on here. Let's see. Dear Rocky, do it to invite you and listen to the Wonderland. Oh, shit. this is uh, an event invitation. You can merge your soul. Whoa, I did not even know this was an event invitation. This is fire. Rooted in wonder. Okay. Then this little fun stuff. Oh, the manicure is still manicuring. Little stickers. We love that. Um. Oh, scratch here to see when it is. I will scratch that later. Um, yo, this is so cool. How do I even? <gasps> wow. This is fire. This is fire. This is fire. Look at this PR GIF. That is so fire. What is, this is just so fire. Look at all of this. Then a description of what each of the products are. This is so fire. 
This is so fire. Shout out to the Purito team. I am so grateful that they sent this package to me. I'm so grateful that they invited me to their event. I'm excited to go. I'm excited to use the products. Like I am, I'm here for it. As y'all see, I have my, my clay mask on right now. Um, oh, I'm so excited for this. I'm so grateful for this. And if you're watching this vlog, stay tuned because I will be capturing their entire event too to share that with y'all as well. Wow. This is lit. This is very, very lit. Good morning. Um, as you can see, it is actually no longer Friday. The first clip when I did the Purito unboxing right here, that was literally on Friday, which was my first day um, after my last final, which was on Thursday. I thought I was gonna start the vlog there, but I literally, all of Friday, all of Saturday, and yesterday was Sunday, I literally slept 16 hours a day. I don't even think I ever left my apartment. Like I woke up, I ordered food off of Coupon Eats, ate, went right back to sleep. Yesterday, Sunday was the first time I even left the house. Oh, I went to the laundromat because I have a, well, you can't see it, but I have a washer in my apartment, but it doesn't fit like the big comforter for my bed. So yesterday was the first time I found like a Korean public laundromat, which fun fact, they actually give you free laundry detergent and fabric softener. So, I was like, yo, that's actually pretty dope. And the fact that they have dryers makes me actually kind of want to do all my laundry there because here in my apartment, I have a washer, but I do not have a dryer. 
Um, I have a washer, but I do not have a dryer here, like most Korean apartments. So there's just like a drying rack, but then it takes like two days to dry your clothes. So if you need something today, you'll never be able to just like wash it and have it. Anywho, today is Monday, and now I feel like it's my first official day of my semester break. This little burrito box, like I don't necessarily know what to do with it because it's so pretty that I don't want to just like... I don't want to throw the casing out and I also know that Korea has such like strict <sighs> Korea has such strict recycling rules that like I'm also scared to like get it wrong because they will come knocking at your door they will bring the trash back to your door and they will like yell at you in full Korean um yes and you will be scared because you don't know what's going on and if you're like me, you might cry the first time. Also, um, you saw me like refilling my humidifier. So when I first moved to Korea, my apartment was literally making me sick, like physically sick. And I didn't understand why, but two things that no one told me is like, one, I moved in the winter. It was December 5th when I moved here. Very, very, very dry air. I needed a humidifier in my apartment ASAP. And the second thing I needed was a air purifier ASAP. I knew the air quality outside was bad, but I didn't also know that like the air quality inside your apartment could be bad as well. It just didn't really register to me. Um, so yeah, my apartment was literally making me sick when I first moved here until I got a humidifier and also an air purifier. And I'll talk about the air purifiers more maybe in another video or something because I actually, the first one I got didn't really work. It was okay, but then I started getting sick again. So I had to get like an upgraded one. It was like a whole thing. And when I mean like sick, I mean like I would be perfectly fine outside all day, classes, all of that, with my friends, all of that perfectly fine and then as soon as I come in my apartment and just I sit in here for five minutes I would get like congested I couldn't like breathe like I was blowing my nose and it was like bleeding and bloody it was just like the works and I think because like one the air quality was so bad that I was like coughing and it was causing like congestion and then two the air was so dry because I didn't have a humidifier that like the air that I was like breathing in and blowing out was so harsh that it was like causing nosebleeds. It was like a whole thing. Like, I, man, it's a lot of things they don't tell you when you move to a foreign place and things that are just like no brainers for like natives and people who've grown up here were so unknown to me. And I just like figured it out by getting sick in my apartment and figuring out like, how do I not be sick in my apartment? All those good things, but anyway,
My face was feeling really dry after the gym today in the shower, so I'm doing this quick little face mask um, before we get going on with the rest of our day. As you notice, I do cut my sheet mask right here just because I feel like it fits my face better. And whenever you don't cut your sheet mask, it's like covering your eye. It just, the mask doesn't go where you need it to go for your face. So pro tip, cut your sheet mask right there in the middle and then you can place them where you need it to be. So we're gonna do this and let our skin actually get some like hydrated and all of that good stuff. And then we will keep going. Yes. Since we're here, let's do a quick little peek at what is on my desk. Um, this, as you can see, my journal that I just used this morning before the gym. This little thing is great. It's a TikTok light. I call it the TikTok light because it was popular on TikTok. TikTok. But the best little pocket light ever. Um, it has like different settings and stuff too. So, um, this is a tripod that stands really tall. Um, so like if I need any like full body shots and stuff, if you don't know, I was making content on Instagram before YouTube. So, um, go to the link in the description to check out my Instagram content. These little things are cute. They're actually, they're like Mickey Mouse from like Walt Disney World, Mickey Mouse. They're actually salt shakers. You're supposed to put salt in here and then use them as like salt shakers, but I got them and just decided to use them as like little like trophy things. Here we have like all of like my little school stuff and notebooks and folders organized. I didn't even realize, but it's like organized in terms of height. And I guess it just helps me like quickly like look at it and identify like what each thing is um, because I can see each one. Um, this is like a, an, an adapter that, uh, because all of my products are still like US-based plugs, like I have to use adapters to like use the outlets in Korea. But also what this does, it not only is an adapter, but it's a power converter. Because in Korea, they use like 220 volts. And in the US, we use 110. So I had to get something that like lessened the power. So that way my items like work with it. Here's another little um, tripod thing because yes, content is everything. Um, just like little computer stuff. This is like what, iPad pen, whatever. Um, I use, so it's like a little notebook, chapstick. Um, this is my iPad that I carry around with me like on a daily basis and then my MacBook. And I don't know about y'all, but I need to use like a wireless mouse when I'm using my MacBook, like I have to. Um, and then just like adapters for like my memory cards, for my cameras and stuff like that. What's in these little things? Oh, just like some little gadgets and gadgets, little things What's in here. Oh, more like gadgets and gadgets and things. I know, I know. I saw you trying to get it. Yeah, yeah. I forgot. 
I know, I know, I saw you trying to get it. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, it's good. definitely, I'm going to be a weekend friend now because first semester was cool because first semester was cool because it was just like, I have, I've known this stuff already. Wow, burnt okay. my damn tongue. Oh, no. Woo! This is my song. Thank you. 